More than 100 million Pakistanis are unbanked. They account for 5% of the world's unbanked population. Millions of Pakistanis turn to Central Directorate of National Savings with all their trust. We make up to 29% of the country's entire banking sector deposits. At National Savings, we make sure that our customers' savings grow to provide them with financial security free from external shocks rather than just being parked. Mera Barosa National Saving. Pakistan is also among 25 countries the World Bank Group and partners are prioritizing as part of the efforts to reach optimal universal financial level by 2020. Introducing the new face of Pakistan. These two years have been a phenomenal experience for me with National Savings. Joined in August 2016, the objective is to include as many people as possible in every nook and corner of the country. Pakistan, land of the pure, officially home to over 210 million people who speak 72 languages and belong to different cultures and ethnicities. Pakistan is a country just 71 years young. It all started 140 years ago when, in 1873, the concept of National Savings Bank was created by the British in Southeast Asia. National Savings Organization Pakistan is the non-banking bank in Pakistan. After 1947, Pakistan was born in Pakistan, the Bureau of Pakistan was born in Pakistan, and in 1953, its name was Central Director of National Savings. In 1960, it was made by the Ministry of Finance. And in 1972, National Savings को तमाम saving schemes जारी करने का और उसके इनकैश करने का अख्तियार दिया गया। Today in 2018, CDNS, or popularly named National Savings, is the trusted partner of millions of investors who are earning a safe and profitable livelihood. Our products and services are at par with any international savings. The most popular are welfare products and also prize bonds, being an efficient tool for financial inclusion and social security. मैं डीएचए इस्लामाबाद का रहशी हूँ नेशनल सेंटर तारकाबाद में दो अकाउंट खोल रखे हैं पिछले 22 साल से मैं इस सेंटर का कस्टमर हूँ मेरे बुढ़ापे का सहारा नेशनल सेविंग की स्कीमें हैं सीडीएनएस आल्सो बेस द क्राउन ऑफ बीइंग वन ऑफ द फ्यू फाइनेंशियल मॉडल्स ग्लोबली विथ ए लार्ज नेटवर्क ऑफ making it accessible all over the country. 7 million plus accounts and certificates including post offices and commercial banks along with 414 million pieces of prize bonds. Currently National Saving working on adaptation of latest tools and technologies in the field of IT to transform the organization from manual to electronic. In the last one and a half year National Saving has achieved a considerable progress in the field of IT. The social welfare products of national savings remain largely insensitive to the interest rates. The greater idea is to provide the investor a valuable amount of profit every month to live in the society with respect and dignity. Almost 50% of the total profit that national savings pay out every year goes for these welfare schemes which shows the government's unwavering commitment towards the deserving sections of the society. The idea is to include as many people into the folds of savings as possible. Shohada families, the martyr, uh, the disabled persons, the widows. So you could feel that you have contributed something towards the society. This is my time of giving back towards our own people and our own society. उस बचत में कुछ न कुछ हासिल करना चाहते हैं और उसको हासिल करने के लिए ये महाना बचत स्कीम कॉमी बचत वालों ने जो चलाई है और छह महीने की भी है और तीन महीने की भी है वो हम उनके दर पे जाते हैं और कुछ न कुछ तो मिल जाता है। With a literacy rate of 60 percent, educating the public about the products and services of CDNS is also important. We, the female officers in National Savings Organisation, are proudly discharging our job and playing our role in the development of the organization and also towards achievement of its goal. National savings remain the most effective and formidable vehicle to support financial inclusion, particularly women. More than 50% of the investors of national savings are women, 
versus merely less than 4% in the banking sector and average 25% in South Asia. A testament of true financial inclusion and women empowerment. As the world ventures into digitization, Pakistan is also hopping onto the bandwagon. CDNS, being at the front of this race, started digitization of its processes and huge data bank. Last 10 years, National Savings has been on a reform agenda. It has emerged as a formidable vehicle for uh, financial inclusion and as a provider of social security for the vulnerable sections of the society. Various steps have been uh, taken in this regard. For example, the automization of data, the clearance of checks through NIFT, and now the launch of the digital mobile app. All these steps have been taken uh, to greatly reduce the transaction time for the clients. And now the clients don't have to wait in long queues and their check gets cleared in about less than a minute. All these initiatives have uh, helped National Savings to, uh, to transform from a manually run organization into a digital financial platform to ensure maximum quality service for our esteemed clients because our clients are our topmost priority. Another breakthrough service was the launch of the CDNS app. With a mobile user population of over 140 million, with a 30% penetration of smartphones, internet data usage has become a necessity in Pakistan. With assistance and efforts from all our partners, the National Savings Organization is leading the digitization process for millions across the country. With the digitization of CDNS, it is now more convenient to save compared to traditional banks. What we have been able to achieve in the last couple of years, we have surely not been able to achieve that in the last couple of decades. All happened because of the positive attitude of our people, their commitment to deliver the best-in-class services to their customers. So at the end, I would really like to have a round of applause for my people. Well done. Keep it up. To know more about our successful digital transformation, www.savings.gov.pk